everyone. Uh, I met a Geordie philosopher the other day. He said to me, why I, man? <laughs> I said, I said, I don't know, mate, I'm just trying to piss here. <laughs> uh, I'll tell you a little bit about myself. Uh, my mother is English and my father is Iranian. And it is quite weird being, like, white, but not technically white. Like, I enjoy the advantages of being white, but I can't join any hate groups. <laughs> Uh, a lot of people say that Donald Trump has uh, Alzheimer's, uh, but correct me if I'm wrong, but Alzheimer's is a disease, not an opinion. Uh, in my opinion, I think Donald Trump has an underactive thyroid. <laughs> Get that checked out. Uh, I'm very grateful I'm a human being. I don't think I could do anything else. Uh, <laughs> Apart from a panda. Because think about it, a panda doesn't have any responsibilities today. The only responsibility a panda has is to impregnate another panda. I reckon I could do that. <laughs> once you do it once, you know, you're no longer a panda, are you? You're the panda then. <laughs> Get yourself on a good little breeding program. Before you know it, you're fucking a giraffe, and you. <laughs> uh, I've been having really bad dreams recently, like uh, hellacious dreams, uh, nightmares, in fact. So I bought myself a dream catcher. Uh, the whole purpose of a dream catcher is you're meant to put it near the place you sleep to catch bad dreams. So I put it in my bedpost to catch the bad dreams. But last night, it caught a wet dream. <laughs> uh, it's just ruined now. Uh, <laughs> probably going to have to buy a new one. <laughs> to be honest, it's, it's been a bit of a nightmare. <laughs> Uh, just, uh, just wearing glasses at the moment. Uh, I really hate wearing glasses. I don't have to because my eyesight or anything. It's just a person whose identity I'm stealing always wears them. <laughs> Things we do for love, eh? <laughs> uh, I used to have very oily skin. So what I did was I stopped putting oil on my skin. <laughs> Uh, it really cleared up. <laughs> uh, I feel very comfortable in my skin now. Uh, I've tried on other people's skin in the past. <laughs> it just made me feel really self-conscious. You know? uh, I broke up with my dominatrix last week. I just always resented having to do everything in a relationship, you know. <laughs> I took her to one side, I said, look, mistress, if that is your real name. <laughs> it's not, it's not. I said, you really hurt me in the past, and I just can't be tied down at the moment. <laughs> uh, I've got a confession to make, guys. I'm a, I'm a compulsive liar. Uh, but there's always a shred of truth to my lies. For example, I once told a woman that I'm hung like a horse, when the truth is, I hanged the horse because he laughed at my cock. <laughs> uh, true story. True story. Uh, always remember that in life, the race is long, and in the end, it's only with yourself. Unless you're a Siamese twin. <laughs> In which case, the last one to die wins.
Right, I'll leave you on a more positive note. Uh, whenever I'm feeling a little bit down, I like to go and buy a doner kebab. Uh, I don't eat it. It just makes me feel better when someone calls me boss. <laughs> right, that's it for me, guys. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs>